it's experiences like that uh, that I usually wouldn't even talk about. Like, I don't want people to know, or like, I don't talk like online when I post stuff, I never talk about my life. I never talk about who I am as a person. I don't share who I am. I share that I sing. Like, it's really different. I'm sure, Laura, you've been faced with this too. Like, when you talk to an audience, you if you want to engage with them, you have to be open to talking. Like, I'm just trying to experience this now, actually being willing to be vulnerable in that way. Like, I could sing, but talking to the audience, to me, is, like, super scary. I guess it just takes little steps, like, like gig by gig, you just start saying a few more words and like make a joke here and there, even if it's like kind of pathetic. But like, if you don't care, why does it matter that people care for five seconds? You know, because they're gonna forget. They're like drunk or they're gonna hear you sing after. So it doesn't really matter. And just like coming to the realization that so many things really don't matter because everybody's so caught up in their own stuff. Like nobody's gonna spend the two hours that you spent thinking, oh, that sentence that I said was weird. They're just going to think it for five seconds and then it's over. Like they're going to think about their mom, about their life, about even their own songs if you're talking about other musicians. So just realizing that you don't matter as much to other people as you think you do also really helps. I'm wondering if you guys want to talk about the songs that you're going to be singing today and the thought that went into that and if you're going to be doing covers, originals. I'm going to sing a song that I released this past summer called Bright, and it's an original that's the most happy one I've ever written, and at that time, I hadn't experienced love, but I was, it's almost a picture-perfect vision of what I was hoping Mm. love would be, and then it did happen so (laughs) yeah i'm gonna be doing the song called moving on it's the last song that i wrote i actually just posted a video about it i kind of had to write a song for a pitch so i was i had two days to do it and i kind of started with the chorus i was just like strumming on the guitar these four chords over and over and i had this idea of like talking to a girl that's going through a breakup where the guy doesn't really care and you're just like it's okay you just have to let it go but in a I guess an uplifting way I feel like there's many emotions in this song but yeah this is the last song one of the first songs that written in guitar actually the second one and it's kind of more like country-ish pop like Taylor Swift country but happy so yeah that's kind of like the gist of it